Hi YouTube, it's Queen Pam Elon47, and I'm here with a more in-depth product review from some fine um, applicator bottles that I got from Gaunt Industries. If it will focus, guess not. Here we go. They're on the internet. They ship really quickly. I ordered a sampler pack, which you have to call them in order to do. And just because I wasn't sure what size tips I was going to like. And what I did was um, I mixed up some craft paint with some water and ran lines of the sizes that I had. All except one, I didn't run a line of the 18 gauge. And the 18 gauge I thought I would get for like glue or paint, but I see now that I really want like the 23, the 25, and this is the 27. I didn't write that one down. 27 gauge. So that's how they come out. 14 and 16 are pretty big, so you probably could use them for, you know, glues for sure. 20, 23, 25. So if you're really looking for something that um, comes out smoothly, there you go. And then I also bought some spray bottles from... Oh, I will have to put the name of the company in the description box because I didn't uh, remember. I thought I would, but I didn't. And I like it because it's got that kind of a sprayer and not the kind, you know, that, that's on top. I like this. It also locks so that you can, you know, you can't, you can't accidentally spray it if you were traveling with it. And it makes a nice spray of the paint. And if you really you can get a um, a good mist of water but it's not doing so well with the paint but um, I was really happy with the sprayers and also with the Gaunt Industries fine needle tip things now the, the thing you need to know about the Gaunt Industry thing is that you really can't like leave your paint in it because they do come with um, caps but the cap is not the kind with the needle in it that would go down in there and keep that open so i plan to you know just put a little paint in when i finish my product project i'm i'm going to cap it with the caps that i bought also you know so that i don't waste paint and then just rinse my needles out so i'm thinking i'm going to be getting some more of the 25 and 23 and possibly the 27 gauge for uh, painting and mixed media. Could you see writing with the 27 gauge with white paint? No more, you know, paint pen headaches or, you know, things that don't show up. So as always, I leave you in the hands of the creator. Be blessed.